Hey, this is Liz from Her DIY Dream Home, and today we're tackling the floors, cabinets, and tile. So the floors, unfortunately, I did not shoot any video footage of finishing at all, but I did want to share that I did a polished floor using this company's product, Concrete Floor Supply. They have a level two polishing system. It's a diamond impregnated uh, polishing pads using a floor buffer. Um, it's a wet polishing system and it took off the top layer of the concrete to create kind of a speckled polished floor and it's exactly what I wanted. After the floors were polished, I was able to install this cabinet. This is actually a credenza that I've had for a really long time. And then I ordered some RTA cabinets ready to assemble cabinetry and installed those. Since this is my mudroom in the end, I actually got an under counter refrigerator and freezer combination and installed those. Eventually I'll pull that out and then I'll do like uh, laundry storage. At the same time, I was working on the floor pan for my walk-in shower. Um, I went with this Flow FX uh, shower drain that I actually saw on another YouTube channel tile coach. It seemed like a really easy option. I just followed the steps and I think it turned out really well. I was super happy with everything. Then after that, I started working on the tile on the floor. I went with this tumbled glass mosaic in a barrel shape. And I think it looked pretty good. Um, I'm not a tile professional, but my whole thing is I can do a bad job for free. And so it's not perfect. But I think overall it went pretty well. From there, I started going up the walls. I'm using a four by 16 field tile. I got these for a great price, uh, price on Facebook Marketplace and I just started working my way up. Um, I have a bunch of pictures of my progress as I went around. This took a really long time. I was very tired of tiling by the time I got done. I did like 450 square feet of tile in this bathroom. It was crazy. Once I got about 30 inches up all the way around, I actually had to pause because my uh, countertop guy came and installed all of the counters and shelves and stuff. Um, you can kind of see the countertop for my credenza. That right there is a little shelf in the shower for all my shampoos. And then another picture was a pic divider between the bathroom or the toilet and the tub. And then I also installed the butcher block countertop in the uh, mudroom. After that was finished, I continued up putting in this little piece of pencil tile for interest, and then I topped the whole thing with a piece of brass topping hardware. I got, I got stuff everywhere. A complete mess. It took, it's still, I'm still cleaning up grout and mastic. It's crazy. But everything, I think, turned out pretty good for being an amateur tile person. This is the backsplash behind the mirror above the vanity. Um, I, like I said, I think everything turned out great. And not to keep you in suspense, here is a quick video of what the bathroom looks like today. I shot this this morning really quick so you can kind of get an idea of what the finished look looks like. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and look out for the next video. Um, I think I'm going to do the exterior siding and painting. Thank you.